leads his nation of domination to the ring. Of course, uh, as we mentioned, one week from uh, tonight in Chattanooga's UTC Arena on pay-per-view. It'll be Farouk Savio Vega and Crush facing Goldust, Rocky Maivia, and Flash Funk in a big six-man tag team matchup. It's going to be interesting to see the teamwork of the Nation of Domination in a six-man tag match for the first By time. Any what a great necessary. By any means necessary. What a great in-your-house card. Also sees the British Bulldog hey, boy, and I'm Owen Hart against Furness and LeBron for the tag team title as well. School. Quite an entourage. And as uh, Get down is... on your knees and put one fist in the air and salute them. Well, we're going to get started right here. And while they were still talking, Ken Riha, but he didn't say yeehaw, he said, oh my gosh, when Farouk just put his boot right in Ken's face. Well, Riha may have said, uh, oh my gosh, when he saw the uh, name of the opponent on the contract for this morning's contest. Farouk has been assaulting, dominating, and physically just uh, annihilating anybody that steps in the ring with him, and he has been as hot as any competitor in the WWF. I like all those adjectives you, you just came up with. I talked to the president of the JR fan club, Tommy Noe, down here in Tennessee, and he said that he just loves your verbiage, JR. Well, Clarence Mason looking on here. Of course, the Nation of Domination in the Middlelands this afternoon at 2 o'clock, and they will also be in Lowell, Massachusetts to be a part of Thursday Raw Thursday, this Thursday in Lowell. What a big slam, and now Farouk hits the ropes and a diving headbutt, and he rammed him. Ladies and gentlemen, Stone Cold Steve Austin colliding with Vader momentarily here this morning. Stone Cold, you're a week away from the Final Four. Could this be a mistake taking this match uh, just a week away from the big one? I ain't made a mistake since I've been in the WWF, son, except that I'm not kissing up to all the gladhanders up there in the office. Vader's going to realize that Austin's time has come. I don't give a rat's if it's a week or a day before the pay-per-view. The bottom line is I will eliminate Vader, The Undertaker, and Bret Hart. But right now, Vader's going to get his whipped. Well, I'll tell you, so this going to be, I, we talked about explosiveness. We talked about the potentiality of, a, of aggression, shall we say. We will see that this morning in that tough man matchup, that rematch from Raw involving Vader and Stone Cold. Bret Hart will be joining us uh, uh, just a little bit later here this morning for color commentary as well. Yeah, and I'll tell you something, I, nothing was settled between Austin and Vader, so I'm looking forward to seeing it today. You know, Steve Austin's interviews are starting to sound more and more like an emergency broadcast system test. Uh-oh, here comes the Dominator. Yes! Oh, the Dominator is... Dominated. It's devastating, I'll tell you. Six-man tag action in Chattanooga next Sunday for the Nation of Domination, but they will be in mass on live television this Thursday night live here on the USA Network. It keeps growing and growing. Members being added almost daily. What a conglomeration, the Nation of Domination. We'll be back in 60 seconds with the Hitman.